On April 10th, students held a sit-in at City Hall to protest the possible reduction of the theater teacher position currently held by Dave Grout. Both Superintendent Portia Bonner and Mayor Gina Louise Shara spoke with students about their concerns during the sit-in. The following day, a second protest was held during the school committee meeting where members were set to vote on the budget. After 90 minutes of public comment, where many of the speakers again expressed their concerns around the reduction of the theater department, the school committee voted to approve a level services budget. This budget would maintain the services currently provided in the district. We spoke to student activists to learn more. The cuts that were proposed in the 4% increase budget would completely get rid of the theater department. So, because the theater department is one teacher, Dave Grout, that position, um, if that position is cut, there are no acting classes, no play, and the musical would be very much hurt because there would not be an in-house director or theater teacher to work on that with Susan. If the budget cuts include a cut to the theater department, it would be a cut to the theater teacher which means we would lose our only adult support for the technical theater department. Students take a lead on a lot of events. Um, Dave helps us run behind the scenes stuff and he helps us manage and make sure there are people to run the events and if there aren't, he will run the events. Noah Dalbyville Watt and I both organized the sit-in because we felt that it was a different and effective way to make our student voices heard to City Hall and to our elected officials. It isn't just teachers being upset because they might lose their jobs, but students being upset because we are losing very important people to us as students and to us as a school. Thanks for watching. This approval will now go to the City Council for revision, so make sure to stay tuned for future public meetings. See you next week.